Carmen, a little less picturesque here uh, in Hartford because we're along I-84 east and west, but I'll tell you what's a good site. We did this shot a year ago. There was hardly anybody on the road given the COVID uh, issues going on, but we are coming around the bend. We're turning the corner and it's not such a bad thing to see traffic here on I-84. Uh, people going in all sorts of directions on this Memorial Day weekend. About 1.7 million New Englanders hitting the roads and the airports. That means a big boost for restaurants and attractions. The temps might be a little low, but business is picking up and the summer season has started. The unofficial start to summer is ready to launch. In Collinsville, there are less restrictions and there's more to look forward to. I feel like, you know, we're free all of a sudden. 2020 brought ebbs and flows to Collinsville Canoe and Kayak. The boating scene saw a boost after the pandemic hit. And fortunately for the family owned business, the start of the new season shows no signs of the tide turning. We thought we were going to be regulated like last year, very limited amount of rentals and um, everything's gotten more relaxed, you know, with so many uh, such a great percentage of Connecticut residents being vaccinated. We're in great shape and we are able to go resume our normal rental operations this year and we're doing hourly rentals and people are so happy about that. A different scene, but equally as serene in Simsbury, where there is relief at popular mill rights. Like so many Connecticut restaurants, the Memorial Day weekend opens more doors to recovery. Business is up. It's, it's, it's up from uh, 2020, certainly. Owner and top chef Tyler Anderson is expanding. He's in the process of building a California-style taqueria on premises. Now we're looking at business coming back to normal and we just, you know, hope people stick around for the summer. We know that things have changed for people and that people really want to dine out outside still. And so here, and I think at many restaurants, we're creating these outdoor dining experiences that add on and those will help us make up for lost revenue from last year. And beginning this weekend, it appears the table is set. I'm most looking forward to getting back to normal, like getting back to business and uh, people feeling comfortable being in restaurants. And good to see Tyler doing well and back in business. AAA also tells us that air travel up 600% over 2020. 